bed, guys. I look like a disheveled mess. I literally just put this on. I have my earrings in my lap. Oh, my belly's out. Ooh, my chubby belly. I have my earrings in my lap. I, I didn't even do my hair. My Okay, let's start at the beginning. Happy Earth Day. Um, It's April 22nd. It's 4.16 right now. I was so bad about vlogging today, but um, I went to my appointment this morning and it was canceled. So I went back home um, literally for like maybe an hour. Uh, did a couple of things and then yeah and then went to meet up with my friend and we went bike riding now guys I told you I don't know how to ride a bike um I mean I've ridden a bike before when I was little but barely and it wasn't that bad I actually did okay I didn't fall and bust my ass and I learned how to turn without having to get up off the bike turn the bike and then get back on which is what I used to do when I was a little girl so it was cool I freaked out like twice because we were actually riding like in the street in traffic because apparently you're not allowed to ride on the sidewalk um yeah but we did that and then we went to bear burger which has like weird ass kind of burgers but I just got a regular like they have like wild boar and elk and bison like it's really weird but I just got a regular burger yeah for real? yeah for real they make burgers no that there, it says there's a bull there boar wild boar a wild boar is like a kind of pig for real there's a pig there yeah in the burger they make burgers out of the meat yeah poor animals um well whatever so people are type of animals yeah we're human beings we are a type of animal no <laughs> persons are animals mm -hmm. what are they called again homo sapiens homo sapiens yeah how do you know that word what okay well whatever you then, just told me yeah then there was a lot are you of crazy there was a lot of traffic getting crazy? back noel Noel. Noel. Is that what kinds of crazy? Is that what you say to mommy? No. Do you speak like that to people? Yeah. No. Do you want somebody to speak like that to you? No. So then why would you say something like that to somebody else? That's not nice. That's very rude. Um, we were late. Oh, I was running late. Noel, don't say what you hear grandma say. <laughs> I was running late to get him. There was so much traffic. It was just literally whatever. And then I, when I finally got home, I had an event with Self Magazine tonight. So I literally had like all of 15, 20 minutes to get ready and leave. So I jumped in the shower because I was all sweaty from bike riding. Um, quickest shower of my life. Obviously, I still haven't even fixed my hair. Like I have stuff in that bag. I have my shoes. I have you more makeup. Bike riding today? I did. I did the quickest smoky eye ever. You guys kind of see that. I know my eyeliner is definitely not even. I um, want to see smoky eye. I didn't have time to put on fake lashes. I and I didn't contour or blush or anything, but or lipstick, but I have it all in my bag. Yeah, so this is like... And then I'm really stressed because the L train is still not working, like, at all. So I have to drive downtown to, like, the World Trade Center area or actually the event is in the world trade center building so this is going to be some shit because finding parking over there is santissimo like god is going to really take care of me and love me today and have a parking waiting for me when i get there because i'm already cutting it close it's 4 20 right now oh 4 20 um <sighs> sidetracked oh and my mom gets out of work at 4 30 but i'm almost there so i should be there on time because she already made a show on monday Mondays, you guys know I have school, so I leave him with my mom. She gets out at 4 30, and from there I go to school. Um, and she's like, Oh, he gave me a hard time to put his seatbelt on. Okay, so you turn around and you like, He doesn't do that with me, so I don't know what she's talking about. You just tell him, Put your seatbelt on, and he knows, and he puts his seatbelt on. Um, she's like, He gave me a hard time. I'm never taking him. Don't ever leave him by my job again. I'm never taking him again. I'm like, Okay, well, you understand I have school every Monday, so. I have to leave him at your job to get to school in time. She's like, well, I don't care. Uh, don't leave him for school. Don't leave him when you have an event. Leave him at home by himself. I'm like, like the thing she says is just so illogical. So right now, I'm like, I have to be there at 4.30 on the dot when she gets out. Because if not, 
she probably would be the type to just get in her car and leave if I'm not there yet and be like, well, not my problem. I didn't want to take him anyway. In which case I would have to go all the way back home and leave, whatever. The event starts at five. So God help me. Hopefully I'm not that late. Hopefully there's not that much traffic heading downtown, which is another big issue now because I have to drive downtown. And um, hopefully I find parking. So <laughs> I'm getting really like nervous and stressed just because I'm the type of person that likes everything nice and organized. I'm very OCD. I'm very anal. I'm like such a Virgo. I, I need everything organized. I need to be places early so that I can have my wits about me. You know what I mean? Like a scope out the energy and get there early. I don't know. That's just how I am. So I'm really stressed right now. And then the train and everything. But it was definitely worth it because I really had a great day. And I never thought I would have that much fun bike riding. I was really like, like you guys know I'm simple. I want to go bike riding. I got to buy you a new bike, baby. No, no, no. One. Yeah, you're too big for the other one. And it had a flat tire. Why don't you buy a pump? <laughs> because you're too big for it anyway. Um, no, I'm not. Okay. Um, Let's do the size. We got, we'll check, all right? Mommy needs to get a bike too. I used one of those city bikes today. Um, Oops, city bikes. The blue ones? Wait, hold on. We're passing a church. Um, why, you, why can't you block by church i can block by church i just needed to switch hands so that i could do the sign of the cross Ooh. why because you do that when you pass by a church oh well not i don't do that for all churches i do it for my church um no, this isn't your church this is god's church yeah it's god's church but this is the church that i um did everything did my no. communion no mm -hmm. no you don't i do I, yeah. You can't do that. Okay. Nothing can be made by God. Alright. Except drive or go in his house to visit. Yeah, I go in his house to visit. But by doing the sign of the cross when we pass by his house, it's kind of like saying hello. Like, hi, we're passing by, but we can't come inside today. You know? That's why I do it. Doesn't matter. Okay, hold on guys, let me try to get one earring on at least. He's inside anyway. Mm hmm He doesn't know that you're saying hi. Mm hmm People can't hear you if they're inside somewhere. Mm hmm Yes, God knows when you say hi and God knows when you talk to him. God knows everything, baby. God is What what why He's the he universe, He's the energy. But why does it sound like this when you say Sorry oh guys? My God? I know, people say that and they really shouldn't. It's not, you're not supposed to say that. But just like people are not supposed to say bad words, but they still do. What does, what, what does that mean? Is that a bad word? Oh my God, it's not a bad word, but it's used like when people are frustrated or something. But words, there's bad. Like if someone made a mess yeah. in your room. Yeah, mommy says, oh my God, when you make a mess in my room, right? Okay, I don't know. <laughs> Squish, slash, squishy, mm. We got here first. Mm -mm. Don't you dare do that to the back of my seat. I just went to the car wash, Noelle. Put your feet down right now. Good, I have time to get myself ready. Figure out where the hell I'm going. Pop it into the GPS. Good, good. Where the hell are you? It's 425, so I'm like a where few, I'm like two blocks going? away. So I'll have like four or five minutes Mommy, to get myself together. Going? I told you, I'm going to an event with Self Magazine. No, what, where the hell? To an event, that's where I'm going. What, what the heck? <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> I didn't say that word in a long time. Yeah. What are you so beeping bad. at, dude? I have right away. Who are you beeping at, dude? Right I do not sound like that, okay? My voice is very squeaky, unfortunately. <laughs> I forgot to put on perfume. Thank God I have perfume. I have deodorant. I have a brush in my car. I have a change of underwear in my car. I don't know why. You sound like this. 
I yeah, I do laugh like that sometimes. I don't even know where grandma's no. car is. You see, that's how I know my mom is trying to dodge me because usually when she knows I have to come by, she will tell me where she parked. And today she didn't call to tell me. <laughs> Alright guys, let me go find her car. I'll see you later. Because she doesn't want to You guys want to talk about high tech? This World Trade Center building is high tech. The ele it tells you like the elevator tells you which elevator to take, and then there's no buttons in here. Like it just takes you where you need to go. It's so cool. Okay, I'm late and I had to leave the car in the parking lot, so it's better be worth it. My ears. <laughs> hey guys, I am with Wendy, Avi, and this place is so cool. Like look at the view. It's amazing. I haven't been back since 9-11, so obviously. I've never been back. Nobody hasn't been back. I, mean, I was here when This is my top. You didn't have to press a button in the elevator. I know. It's so cool. Yeah. Um, yeah. But it's let me awesome. give you guys a quick little overview with my eyeball on the edge. And then I will take you through some close-ups. The Twitter's episode is at Soft Max. vlog this because look at how oh, right. absolutely oh, gorgeous true. this is I love it look I just got it so we are on our way to the car slowly that is if Rocio knows where it is yeah I, I see a parking <laughs> sign there it's gotta be that one. okay and we're carrying these heavy ass bags it didn't feel like this far when I walked over there yeah you're like it's one block away yeah that's what it felt it like it's not one block away the okay. other spot was even farther okay okay um, but I was just gonna say, it's pretty oh, weird. This bag is really like 20 pounds or more. It's so heavy, but look, we're not gonna complain because we're grateful 
to try out these products that have won the self. What, are, what is a beauty award or something like that? Are we going straight? Okay, so it's weird to be back because where were you for 9 11, Rocio? Where was I? Yeah. I was in high school, freshman year. So what happened? Like, like, what did you do? Oh, my, my nephew saved me. Your nephew saved no, you? No, it was freshman year. It was like the fourth day of school. I didn't know anybody. Yeah. So I was in the bathroom cutting fourth period. <laughs> yeah. I saw a plane going to the first building. You saw it? I said, what the fuck? That you shit. saw it? I saw it and I'm like, because I was just there looking out the window. I didn't want to be in class. I had no friends. I didn't know nobody. So I was killing time. Oh my God. And I said, this is not, I got scared shit. I said, something is wrong. I went back to class. Like a little while later, they announced the second plane over the loudspeakers and said that there might be a lockdown. Yeah. We might have to stay in the basement. It's a bomb shelter down there. I'm yeah. like, what the hell? The next period was lunch. I didn't know nobody. I go to lunch by myself. We had huge, like, floor, like, huge to the ceiling windows. Yeah. I just thought somebody was gonna come through the freaking window. So I'm sitting in the lunchroom, scared shit, and all of a sudden I see my nephew. And he was like one at the time, or like three. And I didn't see, everything else got fuzzy, and I just saw him with like a big light around him running over to me. What? I'm like, already I'm a few years older than Rocio um, at Juilliard oh, wow. and you were close well no I was like midtown but what I can tell you was that like I was scared because it was my second year in New York I lived in Boston before and what does that say does that say Warren Street I don't know it's church church in Barclay anyway so um, I lost the parking uh oh, okay, I'll be back. We have to find Sorry. the parking lot. Okay, can I just say this is the uh... Are you vlogging? Yeah. I'm vlogging the pain of being beautiful. Oh, Should that be the name you of this? Send me this, this. This is the pain. This is me dying. Look at. Because <laughs> we're going down the hill. Stop it. I want to see you guys walk down. I can't see these heels. No. And they're, cutting, they're cutting into my. I know, I know, I know. Because mean to, I tied them. No, it's I, fine. I don't mean to laugh. We've so all been through this. <laughs> but I tied them too tight and they're really cutting into my ankles. And I'm, it hurts. I'm so sorry. I don't mean to laugh. And we walked seven extra but blocks. But it is very funny <laughs> just for the reality TV ness of this. Oh, to, to vlog hey. About this. We all, we've all been through it, right? Alright, so she's. Anyway, whatever. Okay, bye. Where the hell do I pay? Hey guys, so we're in Mama Sushi and I have to vlog this because this is hysterical. <laughs> we have been talking about how hungry we are and we're dying to eat. And I was in the middle of posting a picture. We're talking about my event and strategizing and stuff. So I'm in the middle of posting a picture and the food comes. And you can't start eating until you take a picture of the food. So I stopped posting my picture, took a picture of the food, finished posting my picture, tagged her in the picture because it's a picture of her. She's replying to me, sitting right next to me, and yet we're still here, now I'm vlogging, and we're still not eating. But we were starving. So I don't want to it. It's like the social media world is just, it's this literally takes over your life. It's ridiculous. But I love you guys, so it's okay. I'll starve for a few minutes for you guys. But, oh, oh, flash, sorry.